Instagram. And this is what I want to set on Instagram. Then we're going to take the diamond prep bit and just really gently prep the natural nail. I tend to leave a little bit of pink bubblegum gel on her nail. Just to act as like a layer. It's actually not pink bubblegum gel, I lie. It's pink press on gel. I don't completely soak it off. I leave just a little bit on. Just a tiny hair. And this bit I literally floated over the entire nail and the skin to keep everything smooth and clean. Is the angle good? Can everybody see? ¿Se ve mejor así o no? ¿O no alcanzas a ver? Sí, está bien. No. ¿No alcanzas a ver? Sí, está bien. Ahí está bien. Where's your office? Ooh. Where is my pink press on gel? So I'm going to use this as my base pink press on gel. I'm going to do a nice thin coat over the entire phalange. This is beautiful just by itself like that is so chic. And this is the color I wear. Everybody always asks, Max, what do you wear on your nails? And this is what I wear 99% of the time. Bake this 30 seconds inside the Barbie lamp. Let me see if I can see the comments on my other telephone. I'm having me a nice cup of coffee too. Helps digest the food. Because after 10, I can't eat anything or drink anything. I'm going to get our medium sculpted almond nails because she doesn't want them really long, unfortunately. So medium sculpted almond is great for people with small hands. It's like the perfect size nail for the girls with the little, little phalanges. Oh, why did this thing turn off? Only the max video. Here it is. I do go through a lot of tripods, yes. <laughs> I 
So we're going to use the famous bubblegum gel in pink. And we are going to pat it to the size of a nail. Beautiful, look at that. So stunning. Am I missing a nail? Or did it move? Oh, no, there it is. the nails are nice and straight especially with someone with limited mobility sometimes their fingers are not in the best position or somebody that has rheumatoid and things like that so the one two three go system really makes it so much easier and less stressful having to apply nails on somebody who does not have necessarily the best hand no están chuecos yo creo verdad se ven derechas la cámara estás tomando al interperio No, está bien. Ahí está. She's not a very good camera person. No. Do you have a starter kit with basics to do my first set? Yes, you can get a one, two, three, go kit, and it comes with pretty much anything you need. Have you tried the silk stick tripod? I've heard mine for photographing for my jewelry for business. Um, I've never heard of that one, but I've tried pretty much all the other ones. I'm gonna have to check it out. I've tried, what was the one that was like really famous? The acorn mount? Icorn, Arcorn? I don't know. But I didn't care for it. It was horrible. Good luck with your surgery and speedy recovery, thank you. Oh, can you open this and see if it works with that lamp? The one that we got yesterday, the camping lamp. Oh, is it the adapter? Yes. Are you going to answer me? Answer you what, Bonita? Please, don't be so aggressive. Take it easy. If you keep um, commenting the same question, the system will flag it as spam, and then I won't see it. So, calm down. It's really hard to get to every single comment during a live stream, so I apologize if I can't get to yours. Can you let me work? Like, don't hold the camera right in front, because I'm gonna hit it, there we go. So, I'm going to... Just really gently refine the shape of the nail. And I'm using a 150 grit fantastic file. Oh, no worries then. No, it's because sometimes people will be like, why aren't you answering my question or why aren't you reading my comment? And it's so hard to get to every single comment, especially when I don't have somebody to read the comments because my tripod broke just before we were about to start filming. And that is what happens in a Max video. That's what makes life interesting, right, you guys? Especially mine. One thing when we're shaping our nails is make sure that the lines are really sharp and crisp so that we get a really beautiful shape, okay?
And now we're gonna go in with the verse bit. We're gonna begin to blend out the kiroko. And for anybody that was asking, because I know a lot of people have been asking since it was sold out, is Flash Gel 147 is back in stock too, so you can get it. So I'm soaking one of my nail care brush wipes in acetone, and I'm just going over the edge of the bit to remove any gel buildup, so that way I can go in and blend in that kiroko. So now let's go in and blend the cuticle area. And you can see it really goes in and removes any excess built up product so easy I wish my nails were skinny you just need some one two three go nails my love can you use base coat but you don't have to I've seen it done either way that is correct do these look like they're pointing upwards? No, they don't. They're actually pointing downwards. Her nails point up, but the nails are pointing down. So if you look at the nails from the side profile view, they're actually slightly going down. Uh oh, did my drill jump? It did, I need to charge it now. Where is my... And then honestly, you guys, I can't remember the last time I charged my drill. That's how long the charge lasts on the mini toy nail drill on the 40k model. Yes. Huh? What do you mean? Well, no, you unplug it from there. From no, from there, round face. That comes out. And then you switch it up with that. That's why it has so many adapters. Did you not have your coffee this morning? Hi from Florida, the gas prices are killing me, that does not sound like fun. What bit are you using? I'm using the verse bit. Do you still have to dehydrate and prime? Yes. Time for a drink. I don't drink alcohol, huh? Uh, Veronica can do it. So fast and easy and less stress on the body. I think you need to move the camera out so that way I can see. Porque se hace una sombra porque pones la cámara enfrente de... Le... Y luego está muy para allá. La tienes que centrar. No, no, no ves aquí no. lo que estás viendo. ¿Por qué? Porque la luz me... Eh... Pues mueve la luz. Ahí está. Porque estás grabando nomás la mitad. Go in with the mixer. I'm 
And I'm just gonna further refine the cuticle, make sure there's absolutely no product stuck to the skin. So that way the nail really looks sculpted. Beautiful. Let us remove the dust. Nice and even. Pues mueve la luz. Pon, no pongas la cámara enfrente de la luz por eso. Okay. Do you guys know this song? Such a good song. Turn the hand over. Check to make sure nothing is wonky. Did it turn on? Did, but it has a whole bunch of adapters to make it fit. Didn't you see that? Really? And none of them fit. So it's a return. Try to get just a card or charger adapter. They don't sell those kinds of things. I'm gonna have to return the whole light. Oh, that arrived already? Do you wanna buy it? Why not? I don't know. Oh, I got Pikachu on Smash Bros. Really? I'm
And then we're gonna use a pink number 20. Why did this one turn off? We're gonna use the color that looks like a real nail, which is a pink 20. It is like a yellowish, natural free edge color. It's really pretty. This color I have been working on for such a long time. And when we finished it, I was like, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Literally, if you want it to look like a real nail, this is the color because the real nail is not white. It has yellow undertones to it. So this is the perfect color. See? Yes. Right I'll put it inside the box because we're going to return everything anyway. Oh, yeah. We bought this camping light that had supposed to have like thousands of luminous or whatever it is to make everything really bright because when you film, especially when you have like a phone like this right on top of what you're doing, it creates a lot of shadow so it's hard to see. So this camera was this camera, this light was used for camping so it's really supposed to illuminate and then when we got it it didn't have an adapter so it's very unfortunate but look how natural that is you guys isn't that beautiful like it looks like her real nails which is what we wanted it's so stunning we're gonna bake that for 30 seconds No, she's not doing a very good job, so. She's not even reading the comments. But she does it on purpose because she doesn't like reading the comments. Veronica told me the same thing too. She's like, I don't want you to do my nails because I don't want her to read the comments. That's why being a model is not for everybody. It's really hard to be a really good model. Because you have to be like, you have to be reading the comments, you have to be holding the camera, you have to be doing this, you have to be doing that. So it's not for everybody. That's why I don't have like, I'll get requests like, can I be a model? And it's like, no, it's not that easy. It's really hard and it's actually a very stressful thing. You're welcome. She's like, thank you for doing the lives. It's part of life, especially like crazy ones like this where like the tripod is broken and like I have a thousand things going on and I have surgery tomorrow. But that's what makes a Max video special. So now we're gonna use the famous flash gel in 147, which has sold officially over 100,000 bottles Worldwide, it is the most famous flash to reflective diamond glitter gel in the universe. Oh, there's no nail there. I'm gonna take my pistachio brush. And then just really gently feather the color towards the back. Okay, let's go ahead and bake that 30 seconds. And then we're gonna use a shiny star in Saturn. What am I going to do for the, oh, what are you gonna do without me? Oh, gosh, that's hard. Cry. I don't know what I'm gonna do with myself for the next couple of days. Hopefully I can come back to work tomorrow's Wednesday, maybe Friday, depending on how I feel.
I do have Bayonetta 2 that I've been dying to play for a really long time because I am one of the few people on this planet that did not, did not like Pokemon Legends Arceus. So I might... I like how she's like random shots of my crotch every once in a while too. Oh my gosh, that is the worst. So I'm gonna use a shiny star on Saturn. And I'm gonna coat the entire nail. La Villa Nuit, the music of the This is beautiful. This is also a no wipe top coat, too, you guys. And all the glitter top coats, don't expect to open them and have them like super heavy glitters. Because that's not the point of a glitter top coat. The glitter, the point of a glitter top coat is to add to the nail, not to take away from it. If you want like a really heavy glitter gel polish, we have that because we have over 800. But remember, with the shiny star series, you just want to add to the nail, give it a little bit of that something something, without being too much. To my night max fix. Oh, that's so sweet. You should do a live using your products. I do, every day. Me three. I know, let's hear it from Max's crotch in random videos, I swear. What a day. Beautiful, let's go ahead and bake this 30 seconds because I'm going to do two coats of gel top coat. The other one will be Wonder Gel because she needs the extra layer of protection because she washes a lot of dishes. I bought her like a huge 500 pack of disposable dishes and she still doesn't like to use them. ¿No te gusta usar taza desechable, verdad? Mmm, no sabe igual. She says the food doesn't taste the same in a disposable plate. But that's true. Like liquid water tastes better in glass than it does in like plastic or cart or styrofoam or whatever. Oh, thank you. So now we're going to use Wonder Gel, and I can't even see what I'm doing because she literally. Ve la cámara, por favor, lo que estás haciendo. No puedo ver porque la pones hacia abajo. Okay. Wonder Gel over the entire nail surface. And here you can see the flash gel flashing up. Look how cute she is. How plain. This is very plain for a Mac. And there we have it, my loves. Easy breezy, simple yet sparkly. Let me turn off some of the headlights so that way we can really see that flash gel. That reflective diamond. Ooh, there she is. Hello, reflective diamond glitter gel. How are you today? Look at that. That's really pretty. 
Well, my loves, that's gonna wrap it up for today's little demo. I hope you guys enjoyed this chaotic one. It was definitely one for the books. And what can I say? I love you guys so much. Thank you for everyone reaching out. And I will see you guys in a few days in the next live video. And hopefully I will not have all the saggy skin that they're gonna cut off. And ooh, who knows, maybe I'll do a shirtless one. I'm just kidding now. <laughs> Bye.